hello guys good morning good afternoon good evening depending on where you're watching this video from and when you're watching this video it's El Zenito. and today we want to look at my top five ai tools now um for me personally i'm one of the um few persons or one of the um, designers out there that believe that ai is meant to be a tool that makes you know life easy for every designer or even every creative or depending on what you use AI to do it. It's meant to make your life easy, not necessarily take your job away. I mean, if AI can take your job, definitely you need to consider something else. So I believe AI is like, it's just like a stepping stone to easier job, you know, easier workflow, you know, depending on what you're doing, right? So today, as a designer, as a creative, I'm going to list out my top five AI tools that I use almost all the time. So yeah let's open up now before i go to that yes i use my um, google chrome like every other person but i've been able to like um incorporate microsoft bing into my google chrome sorry that as i browse or whatever it is i do on my google chrome you can see at the top here i have a reward for it i'm always getting a reward for just browsing and that reward the points that i get can be transformed or can be used for stuff like um xbox um cards or you know discounts stuff like that you know i mean it's better than you just using google chrome and just browsing and you're not i mean you know the idea of web3 is um internet is both for the user and also for the provider anyways let me not bore you with how those so yeah the first ai tool on my list is the popular chat gpt chat gpt is an amazing tool um it's a tool that it's just like having um what's it called it's just like having siri but an advanced form of siri that can give you the any form of information i've explained the use of chat gpt in my previous video you know i've talked about what you can use chat gpt to create you can ask it any form of question it can you can even ask it to create any form of code for you and it will create it in less than 30 seconds so for example <clears throat> create a Python code to run 12 times multiplication multiplication table right and so it's going to create the Python code now the funniest thing is when you take this code you copy it and you take it to Python it runs like it's just so amazing right really really amazing now another thing you can do for you like you can use ChatGPT for use. For example, for me, being an introvert, I sometimes um, run out of content ideas. Yeah, I'm very good with creating visual ideas, but you know, in terms of the content, the copies and stuff, it's usually very, very hard for me. So sometimes I just come down here and I say, okay, you know what? Um, give me, give me 20 creative, um, youtube con um, video ideas right related to graphics and it's going to give you amazing ideas that you can use in your in your video like you can just list out all these um video ideas and you can just take it okay one today one tomorrow <laughs> like it's just so amazing look at the first one is top 10 10 must have design tools for graphic <laughs> designer just like what I'm currently doing now where I'm talking about the five top five AI tools that I use look at they gave you the um, 10 most 10 most have design tools for graphic designers the second is creating a jaw dropping logo design from scratch you know so many ideas up to 20 you can even ask it to give you 30 40 50 and you just create your content strategy and you start working with it you can even tell it to give you to help you draw out a content strategy to give you a script take for example if i say okay um create create a youtube video script right on the topic on the topic so i'm just going to pick one of this then must have design tools for graphic designer now what you are going to do introduction like it's just so powerful so, I mean, this would not take away the job of a content creator. This actually amplifies 
the job of a content creator. A content creator will be able to use this to to ease ease our job, right? Um, I mean, except you're a creative, most um, business persons will not say they want to sit down on chat GPT to start creating content. They don't have that time. They still require you being the content creator to do all these things. So what it does is it makes your work easier. So like it gives you everything you need to see detailed. It's just so amazing. Now, if you're now saying, okay, you know what? I can't use it for like, um, what's it called? You probably want to submit something that is educational, you know, for educational purpose. And, you know, being ChatGPT, there are other tools that can help you refine your words and stuff like that. I've spent too much time on ChatGPT. Let's go to the next tool. So ChatGPT is an amazing tool. You should check it out. Very, very amazing. Every of this link will be dropped in the description. The second and most powerful tool left to me, I mean, for the fact that it's still in beta, like you can see it's in beta. The second is Adobe Podcast. And Adobe Podcast is, is that tool you will have if you do not have like a professional microphone. For example, if you look at me, I'm currently using this um, um, microphone that I got from Jumia for about 11,000. The sound is not so crisp. When you listen to the original sound, like it gives you, if you look at my, if you watch my previous YouTube video, you will definitely know that, I mean, there's a, there's a lot of change. Like my previous YouTube videos, the sound, you can hear noise, you can hear echo, you can hear so many, you know, unnecessary things. But if you look at the recent videos I've been posting now, what I just do is I just pick, I like extract the audio. I, when I extract, I drop it there. When I drop it there, it helps me in refining the audio. And we are good to go. So, for example, look at the original sample. I'm in a conference room with the window open and it's pretty echoey in here too. Not the best place to record. Now, look at the enhanced speech oh. leap. Yeah. Yet yeah, with enhanced speech, like all the background noise and echo is gone. Everything is gone. The background noise, everything is gone. So, um, it's free. Just go to podcast.adobe.com. I'm going to drop the link as well very very amazing too if you don't have the setup like um kagan or you know those are bosses and stuff like that and you just want to do something cool but you still want your um audio to look a bit professional not even a bit like professional adobe podcast is the right tool to use to use um then we have mid journey i mean do i need to talk about this again i i've had um several um, discussions about mid journey you know i've done i think about two to three tutorial on mid journey mid journey is just you know text to image generator it creates this these are stuffs that i've created so far let me see so these are stuffs i've created so far like amazing stuff all through text right and sometimes i mean it's not sometimes you might not even know the prompt to use sometimes you can just come to explore so when you click on explore it will take you to this page called community feed it has like several examples um, of different images that people have created and what you can do is you can look at the one you like you can say okay i like this um this one and i want something similar to this or i want this whole vibe right so what you can do is you can just click on open option then you copy the full command then you can go to the discord and you know create your own um you can add either um lion or something like that you know like you can just pick any of this image here and just copy the command and use it for your own and just tick you know just make some edits to the prompts and you are good to go so mid journey is an amazing tool it is it is not free but it, it has trial version trial version has i think about 20 images um, I am I'm currently subscribed to Midjourney ten dollars per month, and with ten dollars I'm able to create about two hundred images. So yeah, Midjourney is also one amazing um, AI tool that I believe that as a designer you should be using. Um, it might not be in, it might not be something you're using all the time, but but you should definitely be using it. Now, um, for our number four, we have a site called wonder dynamics now this wonder dynamics is also still in its beta right and what it does is like just as it treats it an ai tool that automatically animates lights and composes cg characters into a live action scene now what this does is if you have any video 
no matter the kind of video you have so long as there's a character in that video you can bring in that video here then any character that you want to change in that video you can change it and put something else like a cg character so this is when you um log in first you request as access you'll be granted access um you you know fill in the old details and you log in when you log in you will be um given this platform so you are going to like create a new page or a new project bring in your video when you have your video um, inserted you can then select the character that you want to change and choose any of these cg characters you can see any of these cg characters and immediately you know when you switch it then you can just render now it, i must say it takes a lot of time to render i mean for a 30 second video that i tried it took about um two and a half hours but i mean <laughs> you are literally changing a character to a cg character so yeah just um an heads up so yeah wonder studio is an amazing tool it still needs beta so i mean it might not give you the perfect um you know the perfect um view or the perfect video you're looking for but it's worth the try and last but not the least is microsoft designer microsoft designer is also still in beta but this tool is amazing now this tool is one tool that i know that can take uh, take um you know junior designers out of jobs because this tool any business person any any um what's it called, entrepreneur that do not have the money to probably um hire a designer um and probably has spare time with he, um, with him or her you can just come to this site and just type in any post you want to create and it automatically generates that post then you can make your edit so for example if i say that an instagram an instagram post showcasing showcasing or showing prizes of my cakes and you press generate you just allow it to generate amazing tool anyone so just give it a few moments right so that's generated several um you know examples so you can look for the one that is similar to what you're looking for and you can just press let's say we are going for this you can just press this and press you can either download it directly or you can customize so when you customize it brings up this like the design is given to you like this and just like canva you can make your edits you can bring in a new picture you can change the text change anything you want to change and stuff like that you know you can even add a new page when you add a new page you go and you put in the text again it generates um you know something else if it even has you know other ideas here that you can use like it's just so amazing just really really amazing i'm being the fact that being that it's also in its beta um form i believe that you know given it like few months it's going to go really really crazy and so yeah these are my top five um ai tools in number five i do not really use it i just use it for probably inspiration but the first four i use it almost all the time actually um chat gpt i use it almost every day i spend almost one hour every day on it just seeing you know just checking it out and seeing what it can do then this one um other podcast anytime i have like for example as i'm recording this video now i'm going to definitely use other podcasts to like refine the audio mid journey every day i use it because sometimes i don't create um image images on it right i just go through this whole stuff you know sometimes as a designer um one one way you can increase your um creativity is to also steer at creative stuff so sometimes i just scroll through and just like wow this is amazing this is amazing this is amazing you know something like that so yeah if this is something that um, resonates with you and you're going to be trying them out you know give me a like share comments and also you know just um hit me up if there's any ai tool that probably you have out there and you'd like me to talk about it let me know in the comments as well all right see you next time